From Tech Day 2023, I'm at the Remote Health Tech Boots and I am with Payman from List Digital Department. So Payman, tell me what's happening here. I see so many screens. Hi, oh, yeah, Beja, yeah. We are providing services. In, in summary, we are providing assistive technologies and services in order to help people those are uh, in remote and they have no access or limited access to their clinical services and the clinical setup. We are using lots of different technologies and as you see in here we have lots of devices and uh, lots of uh, let's call it programming languages and uh, artificial intelligence, virtual reality technologies, IoT devices and IoT technology. So we are creating these services uh, for the use of caregivers and uh, patients or normal in individuals that they don't uh, they don't need to have a special uh, caregive uh, services but they need sometimes feedbacks in order to correct their posture and etc and what is new about your innovation i mean uh, that's kind of tool we already saw them somehow but what is the the added value of that's your innovation correct. yeah the added value of this innovation which is developed in list with the uh, least know-how is that we are providing our feedback in real time and it is real time analysis over the data collected from the people especially the data which is getting analyzed on the cloud and the edge is coming and after the analysis it is feeding back into the system assisting the caregiver and the caregiver can use this assistant to just uh, send or uh, give some feedback to the uh, patients or the normal individuals yeah and to to whom that kind of tool are dedicated to some specific caregivers to oh sure they uh, actually the use cases of this technology is extremely massive you can use it in the hospital in the hospital setting and the doctor caregivers they can use this technology to monitor their patients or people those already got some clinical services or rehabilitation and for the moment they are not in the hospital and they are out of the hospital but they need uh, monitoring or uh, this tool can be installed on your uh, smartphone and you can put it in gym you can just uh, film yourself and automatically system without uh, without uh, breaking any rules of uh, GDPR yes. can turn your posture in terms of virtual reality and uh, 3D virtual reality and simply you can see that uh, the feedback coming from AI passing through the caregiver, the caregiver validation, coming to the person who is in gym and he yeah. wants to correct the posture or and the stand. movement and yeah. correct movement. Okay, so for example, myself, I work in the office, yeah. right? So I'm always, always, always on the wrong position. Uh, so um, it means that I could have, I could use this tool to yeah. correct my position because I will have information saying that I'm not in a good posture. Be careful, uh, be straight or uh, anything like that? Exactly. That is one of the main solutions that we have a smart glass in here okay. for people sitting in the offices. We have, all of us, normally uh, have bad seating habits, yes. bad walking habits. And these glasses will help you to correct your posture and will give you very nice feedbacks and you can have an eye on your health and wellness. So the posture correction is one of the main ideas that we have in here. That's very interesting. And what is, last question, what is the future of that kind of technology? Oh, excellent. The future is this. For the moment, we are doing descriptive analysis. Yes. It means we are analyzing your data and we are just uh, translating this data in terms of some specific insight for the caregiver. But for the future, this tool can be a kind of predictive tool and can give some predictions and analysis that you at home can just correct lots of sicknesses or lots of uh, disabilities that might happen to you if you continue like this for example yes and that's that's a solution that is, can predict your future posture or your future correctness of your posture and it can give you a ripple okay. so that's the prediction Phase that we are targeting for the future activities. Thank you very much. You're welcome. That was very fascinating. So, from Tech Day 2023, where List pushes the frontiers of health tech and wellness. Thank you.